and the winds from Tropical Storm K will be especially fierce inland. ABC 10 News reporter Madison Weil is live in Alpine where driving will be treacherous. And Madison, you spoke with some East County San Diegans bracing for tomorrow's weather. Yeah, Kimberly, the wind's not too crazy here in Alpine yet, but we do expect that to change overnight. We've been speaking with people who commute on the 8 freeway every day for work, and they say on days where those winds pick up, it's critical to stay alert and to slow down. In our east valleys and mountain communities, there's a good chance you'll feel those strong, gusty conditions on the road that could push your car around. That high wind watch will be in effect tomorrow morning. It moves you around. You got to be aware. You can kind of see it on the side of the road when it really starts picking up, and that's when you slow it down a little bit. The other concern with the wind is the possibility of downed power lines. As if the heat hasn't been enough to worry about, we spoke with SDG&E. They say they're also gearing up for a busy day of possible outages because of the winds. They're asking people to secure their property and try to prevent any kind of loose debris from flying around and knocking down power lines. If at any time you see a, a tree in the line, if you see a wire on the ground, please stay away from it. Don't assume it's de-energized. SDG&E added that if you do see a downed power line, you should call 911 and notify their company if you can. We're going to have continuing coverage on these expected windy conditions tonight at 11. But for now, live in Alpine, Madison Weil, ABC 10 News. Thank you, Madison.